<laughs> now, Rick, it's been a while since we last yeah. spoke. Uh, the last time we did talk, you were pretty excited about your interview with Phil Esposito that you had done. Yes. Um, yes. I want to know, is there an interview you've done since then that really sticks out and is the memorable Definitely. one for you? Definitely, especially starting a job with like ET Canada. It's like the old job was mainly musicians. I started, I got to interview Phil Esposito on set, but it's been a good six and a half years since we last talked. So yeah, there's been a few in there. <laughs> um, and my favorites, I'm just gonna give you like maybe three. But George Clooney was so, so cool. Like the guy. Also your man crush? He is, he really is, yeah. You all oh, you heard that, eh? <laughs> like the guy has done everything and he's on top of the world and he can have anything he wants and do any project. And uh, when I went in to interview him at the junket for Leatherheads in LA, he got up off his seat, walked over to me, stuck his hand out, introduced himself like I needed to know who he was, yeah. right? Like that's the most <laughs> humble, yeah, right, right? So definitely uh, he's up there. Julia Roberts was a sweetheart. I really loved interviewing her and, uh, and Tom Hanks. Like I loved watching Tom Hanks as a kid growing up on Booze and Buddies and then of course all the movies he's done. So definitely those three like by far are have been my favorites. Not just as interviews but as people. You know, because they're real people. Down to earth. Yeah, very down to earth. Much like you. No well I yeah. You are no. very <laughs> Oh thank you. Thank you. Now you're here doing interviews as well as hosting yes. uh, this evening's yeah, I'll be event. Up on that stage tonight doing the doing the interviews with whoever shows up. Is there one person in particular that you're looking forward to most? Well, I heard at the last minute that Thandie Newton may be arriving, and I love James Bond, and she was one of the Bond girls. Like, there are so many of them. I met two at, at TIFF two weeks ago, so definitely if she shows up, it's going to be amazing. I might, you know, it, it'll be heaven for me. And then looking over the list, there are so many local actors, actresses that are coming tonight. And it's, it's so nice to see them all come to this event because it's such, as you know, you, you live out here, it's such, a, it's such a tight community out here of actors uh, and the, the movie industry. Everyone knows each other. It's like family. So, you know, the, 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 you know hope Steve Basic shows up. And um, I, I saw Jennifer Goodwin on the, uh, on the list. I, I know she's doing some projects in town. Um, Once Upon a Time is a big one for her. That's a huge one, right, right. Richard DeClerc, I just found out, is out of town. I caught up with him on set of CBGB in Savannah a couple months ago. He won't be arriving, but there were a lot of people on the list. Um, I, could, I could name them all for you, but you could probably... Oh. Your mom just gets a I'll get in trouble, eh? <laughs> 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 all right, so I have one last question yes, for you that I ask all of my guests. Mm -hmm. It's about your socks. Yes. Um, I'd like to know what socks you chose to wear tonight. Yeah, I'll show you. Even. Okay. They're, uh, I like uh, these. These aren't as colorful as I usually wear, but there's some there's some pattern to them. They're Calvin Klein's, and uh, lately I've been wearing with my suits more colorful socks. Like I've got bright yellows and, and nice. bright blues and reds and things like that. So see that to me explains your personality. Yeah, That's exactly it. what I expected but, you to but, say. Uh, that I haven't done that for long. It's just over the past maybe eight to eight months to, to a year that I've been starting to do the colorful socks. So, it's so you're coming new. into your true sock choice. Yeah, yeah. And I get to show them off on air every once in a while when we sit at the desk. Our director doesn't mind. My co-host doesn't mind. Cheryl, she loves it. So she actually wants me to come up with my own sock company someday. So maybe I will. I like Lizzie's it. This, All right. So Thank you so much, Rick. My, my, my pleasure. <laughs> pleasure seeing you. <laughs>